Hey everyone, today we jump in to discuss a rivalry. Not just any rivalry, but the game rivalry. Two storied premier colleges in the US. Two of the top colleges in the country. Today we're going to compare the schools of Yale and Harvard. Their football rivalry goes back to 1875. Two Ivy League schools are going to be compared. Each one 119 miles apart. Who is the better value? But first, Welcome to my channel. I talk about jobs, education, careers, and more. If you like information like this, feel free to check out some of my videos. And subscribe if you want to make sure you're getting some good content on careers and education. There are going to be several items that we look at when comparing the two schools. We're going to take a look at student-faculty ratio, acceptance rate, tuition, number of undergrad programs, and graduation rate. The student-faculty ratio is important as it will give you an idea of if you're in a small class or if you're in a sea of people. Acceptance rate will give you an idea of how easy or difficult it is to get into school. Tuition, the price of school. As living expenses can vary and are calculated in crazy ways, the best indicator here is just tuition. The number of degree programs gives you an idea of the options and variety of what you can do at that school. And finally, graduation rate will give you an idea of how many graduate from each school. The higher the percentage, the better. So, we'll go alphabetical order here, and we'll start off with Harvard. Harvard University is a private four-year university located in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Their mascot is the Pilgrim, and Harvard has a student population of 31,655. Harvard has a student-faculty ratio of 7 to 1. The acceptance rate here for 2021 comes in at 4%. Wow, that's low. Harvard's annual tuition comes in at $54,002. With that cost, you have a selection of 57 majors to choose from with 97 distinct degrees. And Harvard's graduation rate is 98%. Now, after those stats, let's take a look at Yale. Yale University is also a private four-year university and is located in New Haven, Connecticut. Their mascot is Handsome Dan, and Yale has a student population of 13,609. The student-faculty ratio here is a very respectable 6 to 1. Acceptance rate comes in at 6.1%. The annual tuition at Yale will run $57,700 in 2021. The number of majors at Yale totals 80 and Yale's graduation rate is 96%. Both of these schools have some pretty amazing statistics. With both schools being in the top five nationally, it's pretty amazing to see such stats for these premier schools. But we need to see a winner. So let's compare the stats. Yale takes the lead edging out in a lower student faculty ratio and a little better acceptance rate. Then Harvard comes back with a lower annual tuition. Yale counters with some more majors to choose from. Then Harvard takes it with best graduation rate at 98%. Wow, 98%. <laughs> That's a new high for me. 98% graduation rate. But who won? Who is the better value? With the comparison, we see the better value is Yale University. Both schools have insanely low student faculty ratio rates. Both are highly regarded schools and both are incredibly hard to get into. Four and 6% acceptance rates will put you in a position where you're crossing your fingers, hoping that you got in. But when comparing the stats, Yale is just a little bit better for the overall value. Now, that was awesome to see the school stats. If you're making a choice between these two schools, let me know what made you decide one over the other. In the football rivalry, the game, between the two schools, Yale is slightly ahead. And in this video, Yale also edges out Harvard just a little bit. With that, thank you for watching. If you got something out of this video, be sure to click the like button. And if you're enjoying my content, please consider subscribing. Click the notification bell, will alert you when I post new videos. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a wonderful day. Be safe, have a good one.